President Obama tips his hand and admits it's pretty weak. In a rare moment of clarity, the President boldly took to the podium yesterday and announced to the world that he has no idea how to respond to the Islamic State. I have consulted with Congress throughout this process, uh, but I don't want to put the cart before the horse. We don't have a strategy yet. We need to make sure that we've got clear plans so that we're developing them. At that point, I will consult with Congress, but there's no point in me asking for action on the part of Congress before I know exactly uh, what it is that uh, is going to be required for us to get the job done. So President Obama admits he has no strategy for dealing with the Islamic threat. Honestly, between golf and vacations, I'm not sure when he would have found time to develop one. He also discussed the importance of acting fast. It is not just part of my responsibility, but it is a sacred duty for me as Commander-in-Chief to protect the American people. That requires me to act fast based on information I receive and look at a broader regional strategy with an international coalition and partners to systematically degrade ISIL's capacity to engage in the terrible violence, not just in Syria, not just in Iraq, but potentially uh, elsewhere if we don't nip this at the bud. He needs to be able to act quickly. Since when? If it wasn't for acting too late, he wouldn't act at all. And what's this about nipping it at the bud? The Islamic threat is well past the budding stage. This thing is in full bloom. Somebody please wake this guy up. It's not every day a world leader admits he has no idea what he's doing. Thanks for listening, and be sure to catch the weekly Ray Warner Show and subscribe at theraywarnershow.com.